Hello and thank you for watching our ActiLife training video. This video will cover the sleep analysis tab in ActiLife. To begin, please open the ActiLife software and click on the sleep tab. You can then proceed with selecting a data set to score. Once the file loads, the data set will appear in the graph window for review. You have the ability to view your sleep data in 24-hour or 48-hour graphs. Users with the Advanced Sleep Feature Package can also view the data as an actigram. This compressed graph is helpful for the visual identification of sleep-wake patterns across multiple days. Next, you will need to select the sleep algorithm that best fits your subject. Actigraph currently has two pre-programmed algorithms to choose from, the SATA algorithm developed for children and the Cole-Kripke algorithm, which was developed for adults. For additional information regarding these algorithms, please click the blue question mark, which will take you to our help page. With the algorithm selected, next you will need to enter the sleep periods. These can be applied by clicking the Add Sleep Period button. This will prompt a floating window where the information can be entered. The period must be defined by the date and time a subject went to sleep and the date and time they woke up. Once these parameters are entered, please click the Accept button to add the sleep period. You will notice that the sleep period will appear in the graph as a different color. For those with the advanced sleep features, you will have the ability to choose the auto score feature, which uses an algorithm to automatically determine the time in bed and the time out of bed. Simply click the detect sleep periods button in the upper right hand corner and the sleep times will be added. If any of these sleep periods need to be adjusted, just click on the time and manually alter it in the sleep period box. Now that the algorithms and sleep periods have been set, you can review the sleep outputs under the sleep period box. These outputs will reflect the sleep period that is selected above. These sleep outputs include sleep onset, sleep latency, wake after sleep onset, total sleep time, awakenings, which can be broken down even further, average length of awakenings, and overall sleep efficiency. You will notice that the sleep graph contains two colors. The total sleep period will contain color over the entire graph. Our sleep period is currently being represented by the pink color in the graph. The green will represent the scored sleep based on the sleep algorithm. Note that you will notice breaks in the scored sleep due to awakenings. Now that the data set has been successfully scored for sleep, you have the ability to view or export the entire sleep epoch breakdown of this file. If the breakdown isn't needed, the scored file can now be downloaded to your records. This can be done by clicking the Export Report option in the lower right corner. This completes the ActiLife Sleep Analysis training video. We hope you enjoyed it and have a great day.